Welcome to my YouTube channel PowerPoint University. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a wheel of fortune in PowerPoint. When I click, the light started blinking and I have added the name of the employees on the wheel. And there's a pointer there for the winner to point the winner. And when I click inside the wheel, it will start spinning. And when I click, it will stop. So this employee is the winner again I will click again it will stop so this randomly it will stop likewise I have created a different background but the animation same when I click it will stop again on click it will start so let's see how to create this slide in PowerPoint add a new slide go to insert shapes and select the oval shape make the height and width as 4.5 inches make it no outline and then align it middle and center go to insert again shapes select a rectangle draw the rectangle and make it no outline and give some different color and width you can make as 0 0.1 or make it 0 0.01 the, the smallest we need and then again align center and align middle press ctrl D to duplicate again make it align center and align middle and then using alt and the right arrow key just bend the rectangles or the lines likewise you can create but just press ctrl d again alt right mouse key so if you can see here i have created the 12 lines select all the shapes under merge shape select fragment and then select the the shapes only which is a kind of a triangle copy this control c go to new slide and paste it Make sure that it is aligned center and aligned middle. You can group this first and then align center and align middle. Again, ungroup this, right mouse click, ungroup, and then start giving different colors to each pie. Don't give similar colors. So just fill all the colors here so all the color has been added now go to insert shapes a select a oval shape and make it again center middle aligned right mouse click go to format shape and give a gradient fill here I have used a combination of uh, something like a gold color. Make it radial. And then go to the 3D format. Select the second one which is angle and increase the width. Can you see here? and then make it no outline you can start adding the text here in this case I'm just going to add the employee name you can add the amount also how much amount if you want they have one change the text direction reduce the font size make it white
here you can just rotate the first select the wheel group it and just rotate it I forgot to rotate uh, add one so just let me add this also again group it control G and slightly rotate it then start adding the names align it properly press ctrl D to duplicate rotate it and add the names to each pie spend some good amount of time here to align it properly and to give the right rotation so I'm just going to add all now so all the names has been added then I'm going to group the wheel again along with the, the names select all the names and select the wheel and press ctrl G to group it and send it to back go to insert shapes or select a hollow circle make the height and width as 4.7 inches and reduce the width make it no outline and then again align center and align middle and give this different color the same color which we have used for the inner circle the golden color and press ctrl D the inner 3d circle and make a different shape select the pentagon this is for the pointer arrow so that we know who is the winner just rotate it and put it on top and then I'm going to use my old presentation which I have used for the light banner to copy the light effect just copy this one and paste it here you can watch that my tutorial on YouTube which is already available in my channel so just copy one by one on each pie by pressing ctrl D add one by one So this lights will start blinking when we play the slideshow. So we just copy the lights. I have copied all the lights there. And you can see here, go to the animation right mouse click effects. Make sure that the repeat until end of the slide because this animation already exists from my previous tutorial so you can see this one the light started blinking you can go to insert shapes select a trapezoid this is to make the stand of the wheel of fortune give some different color make it no outline and send this to back and add the base the top corner rectangle uh, you can use this
and if you want you can give some 3d effect to this so i'm just going to give the add the lights at the bottom of the stand also you can add two three four five whatever number of lights you need and then it's time to give the animation to the wheel select the wheel go to animation enable the animation and go to add animation select spin go to the properties the timing you repeat say until click it's medium so we need to make it fast go again and make this fast or make it very fast and go to trigger it should start happening upon group 31 group 31 is the wheel name you can change that also you can see here when i click it will start spinning and then i have to give the animation for wheel stop also again select the wheel go to animation add animation just say appear double click on the animation appear and again timings go to triggers and say start effect on group 31 again click ok so what will happen now when I bring the cursor inside the wheel when I click it will start spinning again when I click it will stop it on that particular point see this is stopped on the green now again if I stop this stop and the purple here again stop on the green this is on the pur purple now and then if you want to add the background go to insert shape select a rectangle cover the rectangle the slide with the rectangle make it no outline go to format shapes and put a picture fill you can download any good image sunburst image from the internet and use it if you want you can make it more transparent and send this to back so here is our final presentation the slideshow now when I click it will start blinking again when I click it will stop it will start rotating and stopping it will be a great fun for the employees That's it from me friends, thank you for watching my youtube channel and don't forget to subscribe PowerPoint University. See you soon with more interesting stuff, till then goodbye.